Oh, Mulka, how are you gonna help me make this video? Oh, Mulka, Mulka, Mulka. Okay, hold on. I need to move up a little bit. This is not working. Hi, everyone. This is user one. I'm here to talk about my recent ban for deathmatch. Now, today we'll be watching the video that I have of the ban. So, let's get going. Uh, this is not it. Uh, mm -hmm. Shit. Uh, literally shit. Okay. Anyway, alright. Now the cat is out of the way. I want to talk about the ban. Yeah. Oh, wait. Actually, you know what? Let, let's leave that. Let's leave that there. Uh, this is going to become relevant in a moment. So, yeah. My ban. I got banned. Me, Cycle, uh, Turko, I believe. Yeah, Turko was with me. Uh, Turko's friend was also with me, but he didn't get banned for whatever reason, I believe. We were all banned for deathmatch. Isn't that wonderful? Now let me just explain. Fuck! I need to open the door to let the cat out. I will open the door, let the cat out, and I will explain. Okay, I let the, I open the door and let the cat out. Here's the evidence. Gaze without glory, which you already have. 200 views. Fantastic. <laughs> right, let's watch this. So here we are. I have an M4. I gave them a case. We all go in. I paid a shit ton of money. I paid half a million for this. Which was originally meant... Fuck you. Which was originally meant to be a uh, bank heist. But uh, we waited until there were 50 cops. Like admin told us to, then we reported, and admin just didn't respond. So now we're robbing this strip club, I believe. Yeah, this is a strip club. I think. Yeah, this is definitely. Oh no, no, no! This is actually a nightclub that has women dancers. Basically the same thing. So yeah, here we are. Uh, I believe Cycle was being shot at by the guards, as you can see over there, and I take one of the guards down. So. Originally it was meant to be like, we go in, we rob it, we take the shit, and we go out. And this guy, he doesn't obey us, our orders. We said, get down on the ground. He didn't obey it. He got up and he started running. That's why I shot him. I started engaging with this fat guy. Somehow I lost, even though I was playing him with an M4. But uh, I guess you can chalk it up to bad aim or whatever. Uh, and now, just everyone starts getting banned all of a sudden. There you go. Dustin got banned, and then a few minutes later, I'm like, why did he get banned? What the fuck? Why did Toko get banned? So, like, I, it's, yeah, I start PMing him, like, why, wait, how, how did he, how did he DM? What the fuck? Um, and all of a sudden, I got banned as well. Cool. So, what happened? Let me, re let's, let's investigate what happened. We start robbing this place, Toko starts firing, Oh wait, hold on, no, this is a little late. Okay, we start robbing this place. Turku starts firing in midair to get everyone to surrender to them. That's allowed. You can fire a gun if you want, like as long as you're not, like, I think that's a valid reason to fire a gun, you know. They're not obeying, so he started. Uh, Arkwood, he, uh, I don't have his footage yet because this is literally like a couple of hours after I got banned, but uh, he starts engaging with a few people there, and he wasn't even planning to shoot anyone. And you can tell, because he has a fucking AK, and he can't fucking hit anyone, he gets down. Look at this. And I'm like, oh, I need to help Parkwood to not get down, but I'm, I'm a little too late by that point. He was already down. But I'm already there, so might as well shoot at the people that are shooting at me, and the, the, they dumb my friends. So that's what I do. I shoot at the people that shot at me and my friends. So as you can see, I take down uh, that, that guard in the back. I didn't realize at first that I took him down, but I did. You can see like a, a blink. Uh, anyway, we go into cover. And uh, yeah, just like that, we chill there. And this guy, okay, so this is uh, the controversial part. I, I, this is where I assume the admin classified us as DM. So we said, get down, ground, you know, stuff like that. This was our order, and we ordered it at gunpoint. And this guy just gets up and starts running away. Now, what do you expect me to do? You expect me to let him run away? Now, I hate people that just ignore... Um, I hate people that just ignore... Uh, 
uh, guns, you know, they, uh, they, in roleplay cells, they just, uh, someone po points a gun at you and you're like, like, come on, okay, hold on, let me give you an example, right? So imagine you're in real life and like, you're just walking around, just minding your own business, then all of a sudden, you're walking in an alleyway to cut, like, uh, make a, you're going home and you wanna save some time, and all of a sudden you hear this, fucking give your fucking purse or whatever, are you gonna be running away from that? Like, if I'm this close, or whatever, if I have an AK-47, you're not gonna be fucking running away. Or if you are, don't be wondering why you got shot, okay? Because that's what happens when you run away from someone who has a gun. I need to unload this shit again. Fucking... Try to make a point. Because bullets, they kill, and everyone knows that, and it's fucking dumb to run from a gun. And not expect to get shot. So that's why I shot this guy. Now... Here's the big part. Do administrators agree that it's okay to shoot someone for not uh, role-playing fear? Now, here's the fun part. I was recently reported for that match for this exact reason. Now, let's see how that turned out, okay? Here we go. So, this guy, he's like, oh, she, she just DM me for no reason, and he gives us two screenshots. So, we got this screenshot, and we got this screenshot. That, that's all he shows, okay? And he says, uh, I accident hit his car and I drive away after, and then he just shoots me because I didn't pay him money. He didn't mention that I aimed a gun at him. Thankfully, I record everything. So, here's my video. I just show it to him. Look at it, he got all his friends to dislike it. I just love it. Don't you love it when people fucking um, get their friends to dislike unlisted videos? Uh, anyway, so he rounds me, I point a gun at him, he decides to take off. He decides to take off, right? So I shoot at him. Because you fucking... When I'm pointing a gun at you, and you don't obey my orders, what's the point of the gun if I can't use it? What's the point of the fucking gun? What's the point of the gun threat if I can't use the fucking gun? This is the basic thought process. Same thing over here. We threaten this guy, we say, get the fuck down on the ground or we're getting shot because we have a fucking AK-47 and M4s. You gotta get the fuck down. He doesn't. He runs away. Hey! And why do we need him? Because he's a fucking potential hostage. The situation went to shit. The police are probably outside waiting. We need as many hostages as we can get. So we need everyone on the fucking ground. And besides, he probably had some valuables on him that we actually came for. So... That's why we fucking shot him. And that's why we got fucking banned for deathmatch? Let's go back to that situation. Uh, this is the situation where basically all this guy did, I threatened him with a gun, he drove off after I threatened him with a gun. Now first of all, I got jailed for that. I got jailed for that before. Someone threatens me with a gun, I drive off because I'm in a car and I can duck. That's, that's what, that was my thought process. So, I got jailed for that, so I'm like, okay, I guess that's not allowed on LSRP. They never specify. They, LSRP likes to keep their rules vague. Okay, let me, let me go to LSRP rules for a second. They like to keep their fucking rules vague and then punish you so you know, you learn by uh, fucking experience. You learn for, by experience. They never make it clear. I got banned for three weeks one time because I was uh, drive buying as a driver. Okay, fair enough. You know, I didn't, but I didn't know it was, it out, out to aim on some people's head, and it wasn't against the rules, it wasn't listed in the rules, now they added it in the rules, perfect. Anyway, um, so, uh, where's the fucking rules, that is, game rules, there we go. So yeah, I started making uh, videos on this, but, you know, people were like, Oh, you, you don't know the rules. Man, I read these every fucking day. I'm like, uh, like, because uh, every day I get reported, I have to read the rules again. Fuck's sake, this is fucking, am I dumb or something? Or did I not actually break any rules? Because every time it's like, like 99% I don't have to, 99% of the time I don't have to respond to any reports against me. This time, you know, admin was like, okay. He only gave us two, these two screenshots. He didn't give us the rest of the story, so the admin doesn't know anything. He left out the rest of the story on purpose, so that the admin wouldn't know why I shot him at all. He, all, all he's shown is the fact that I killed him in general. I could get reported, like, by anyone that way. 
anyone that I kill. No matter the reason that I have, they can just take a screenshot of me killing them and then go ahead and report me like, oh, you're a DMer. And that ruins my reputation, of course it does. Uh, but uh, I can't do anything about it, I have to respond. So, you know, I have to keep an eye out for these fucking reports and have to be like, dude, you, you ignored my threat. You, I pointed a gun at you, I said, Get, do this thing, and you didn't do this thing, so I had to shoot you. And that thing that I asked you to do was pretty fucking reasonable, okay? I didn't ask you to jump in front of a train. I didn't ask you to jump out of the moving vehicle. I asked you to get out of the car. He didn't do that. So I shot him. I found him again and I shot him. And that was okay, okay? In this situation, this is a heat of the moment situation, right? This is the heat of the moment situation. He just gets up and starts running. This is in the same situation I start to shoot at him, right? And that's what I get banned for, for DM. So here's the question. If I threaten someone with a gun and tell them to do something and then they don't do it, they don't obey and they start to run away, am I allowed to shoot them? Because you just banned me for doing that. You just banned me and Cycle for doing... No, you, you didn't even ban Cycle for that. You banned Cycle for nothing because he didn't even do that. He died before he got a chance to do that. He, he was shooting at those guys because they fucking shot at him. So you're not allowed to even shoot back if someone shoots at you? What the fuck is the point of guns in the first place? Just, just fucking remove all the guns. Fucking uh, vibe, global vibe of all guns. Yeah, I spent half a million on these fucking guns. Because there's a drought, you know. Uh, the guns are so easy, so easy to lose and extremely fucking hard to get. But no one cares about that. No one cares about that. Fucking admin probably has... I mean, no offense, okay, I understand we all have bad days, but you can't just be banning people left and right. You can't just go out of spite and start banning people. Because here's what's going to happen. After I'm banned, after Cycle is banned, we can't apply to SD or PD or government factions for three months unless we get an exception, right? That's not cool. Because I was going to join SD. And you can comment whatever the fuck you want. Fact is, if this is DM, then... This admin that said that I was right is wrong. So you're gonna say that dot hack is wrong? I I won't uh, I won't say that's true. I'm sorry, just ranting about. But I seriously don't know why we got banned. I don't know why we got banned except that an admin had a bad day. There's no other way I can put it. An admin had a bad day, decided to ban all of us. Cycle should not have been banned. He didn't even shoot at the guy, right? I'm not saying that we were wrong for shooting the guy. But he was unarmed, so I can see, like, in theory, admin thinking, like, oh, they shot an unarmed person, so I should ban them. Uh, task complete. But, uh, no, we could shoot him because he didn't obey our fucking orders. That's the point of making threats to people with guns. So, yeah, cool. I've, I've had a lot of... Bullshit bans, right? I had a lot of bullshit bans. I end up reporting a lot of staff team, and here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's why I like LSRP, because these reports are being heard, and most of my staff reports, they get respond. I get response to them, and they get handled. I get unbanned. Now, that is good. That is good for me, because I get response. But here's the thing. I've invested a lot of time in role-playing with Amy. Now you might not know this because I'm not uploading every fucking second of my roleplay. Maybe I have something planned that is secret. For example, today I wanted to release a surprise bank robbery like I usually do. But admins didn't uh, just ignore my request, so I had to do something else. Because, you know, I had Cycle, I had Turco, I wanted everyone to be together. I, want, I actually had Dima as well, but he had to go early, so I had, you know... Yeah, I, I just want to make this nice collaboration of many LSRP YouTubers before I moved on to 5RP. But I'm not gonna lo leave LSRP, obviously. And I do want to make this really big, really final, successful bank heist. But I guess that's not gonna happen for a while. At least one day, you know? It's not gonna happen for at least one day. Because I'm banned. And Cycle is banned. Hashtag unbanned Cycle. Hashtag ban user one and stay awesome.